so hi guys welcome back to my channel so today in this video I am going to review a set of lipsticks and these lipsticks are these yes so they are not Kylie cosmetic lipsticks they are the dupe of Kylie cosmetics uh, lip uh, liquid lipsticks uh, from the brand kiss beauty and uh, I have three shades in uh, them so these are these are three lipsticks and they have not been given any names so they are just numbers given so this is one and this is uh, number two and this is number three so these are the three um, kiss beauty lipsticks which are a dupe of Kylie cosmetic uh, liquid lipsticks and uh, the I personally don't own a Kylie cosmetic uh, liquid lipstick uh, I have gone through the review of uh, those uh, liquid lipsticks and I've and I, I uh, follow uh, Mr. Jovita George a lot and she said that these lipsticks are not worth the price. So uh, I didn't uh, go for buying them and anyways they are way too costly and shipping and everything. It gets really costly to have them so I definitely don't have them so when I saw the dupes of them on Amazon so I thought that I should give it a try and this is how uh, the external packaging of these lip liquid lipsticks look and um, no, it is quite quite similar to the Kylie actual Kylie cosmetic uh, packaging it also has got a lips with dripping lipsticks and uh, no, other things and this uh, also has a matte liquid lipsticks a lipstick and a lip liner which is another uh, part of it and uh, the pricing of these product uh, differs uh, f uh, and it is between the range of 299 to 399 uh, so you can, uh, I'll put the links in the description box, you can go and check that some, like I have bought these three, but one is for 2.99, one is for another 2.90 and one is for 300 or th uh, 300 plus. So that is how the price varies, so you will have to uh, find out the best price for you from, I, I've put down the link so you can go and check it out, so there is no issues. And you, I think uh, this has a lot of uh, shades, I have only bought one, two, three, but I have seen seven also and eight also. So I think it ranges up to 8, so that is there. And this is how uh, the internal packaging is there. So this is a liquid lipstick and that is a lip liner, uh, which are uh, separated through a cardboard uh, separator. And uh, this is how the liquid lipstick looks and uh, this is how the lip liner looks. So it is very, very similar to the Kylie one. I have seen in the reviews it also had a dripping lipstick and all these things. And this body is color coordinated with the color of the lipstick and this is the lip liner which is also quite a dupe I could say. Now I just talk about quickly the internal packaging. So this is how this internal packaging looks. It is quite sturdy, quite nice. This liquid bottle is quite nice. It can go into a bag and fits tightly. There is no problem at all. And this is how the uh, lip liner looks. This, it is a sharpenable pencil. However, in the in the Kylie Cosmetics, I have seen that this is a, that is also a pencil, but that is more waxy kind of a pencil, uh, like a uh, like the Kajals we have. Uh, it is that kind of a lip pencil, but this is a normal pencil, uh, and the texture is uh, if uh, anybody of you would have used the Lacme uh, eyebrow pencil, that kind of a texture it has. So that is quite stiff kind of a texture. It does not show really well on my lips. So that is one thing about this lip liner and this is uh, this is really really nice I really loved this uh, packaging and all and uh, you know this uh, classy look and uh, now I'm just gonna open it for you so that you can see how good or bad it is and um, that is this uh, this is the doe foot applicator which comes uh, with this lip liquid lipstick which is quite good uh, and uh, it is quite nice to apply and other stuff so that is how this outer packaging is all and uh, now we'll move into the texture very quickly the texture is really really nice um, initially it will be a bit sticky on the lips so you have to give it some time and it is better to use it uh, with a lip balm beneath it shines more it is more glossier and uh, it does not uh, dehydrate or so does not dry up your lips so that is uh, a good thing uh, it has a patchy application if you are using it without any uh, liquid, uh, uh, sorry, uh, lip balm. So you must, must, must apply a lip balm. And then if you want to apply the liner, you can apply the liner. Or you can just go directly with this because it has such a great pigmentation. All the three shades which I have have absolutely great pigmentation. So there is no doubt about it. And uh, the um, 
Uh, you have to just apply a single swipe and it covers the entire lip so it is how that magical it is so uh, I really like the texture of uh, these liquid lipsticks although a bit patchy and sticky initially uh, but I think uh, it's, uh, once it settles down on the lips it, it uh, really becomes a part of your lips so that is really nice and they're absolutely non-transferable so once they're set once they convert to matte they are absolutely non-transferable so that is also one really really great thing about these uh, liquid lipsticks and now let us uh, swatch and uh, apply them and see how they look on me. So guys, the first shade which I have applied is uh, 101 and you can see this is 01. And this is how it looks on my lips. It's a rusty brown kind of a shade. And this is the swatch of uh, the shade and the lip liner. Which, but I am not using the lip liners of uh, these uh, liquid uh, lipsticks so i don't know how to you know how i am gonna review them so uh, i have tried to apply them on my lips you know i have tried to completely fill in my lips with these so they are good to fill in but a little bit draggy and all so it is i recommend that you apply a lip balm beneath it and then apply this and uh, as you can see this is a bit sticky initially but later on it will be normal so uh, that's this stickiness will go and this is how it will look I am absolutely in love with this rusty brown color you know this was uh, one color which is very famous from Kylie I think and it is a great dupe of that I think I, I, I absolutely love this and I'm, I've been using it for my daily use and I'm just loving it guys so this is the shade number 01 and this is how it looks on my hand and now we'll swatch and uh, uh, see the shade number 02 so this is the shade 02, it looks on my lips, it's a beautiful, beautiful red, orange kind of a shade and it's completely matte. I mean there is no doubt about it that it's not matte, it is how matte it is. And this is the swatch of uh, the lip pencil and the liquid lipstick and I absolutely love uh, it. Uh, it has a good pigmentation guys, that's I, I mentioned earlier also. That these liquid lipsticks have great pigmentation so there is no doubt about that this and I really like the shade so this is quite a night fun kind of a shade and I absolutely love it it suits me really well so you know, sometimes I you know, sometimes I buy shades and they don't suit me well but these all the three shades which I bought they suit me really really well and this one also I really like this shade also on me and it makes my teeth look quite whiter also so this is how this shade number 02 looks and now I'll uh, show you and apply the shade number 03 so you can see that how good pigmentation is there in these liquid lipsticks. So now we'll move on to shade number 03. So this is another swatch of uh, shade number 03 looks on my hand. That is, that is the lip liner uh, along with it. And now I'll apply. This is how the shade number 03 looks. And you can see it here also. So now let me apply it on my lips and you can see that how they look. And... You can see how well pigmented they are. I mean, it is too beyond. Uh, so this is how this uh, shade looks after it has turned into matte. Uh, it is such a rose petal kind of a shade. I absolutely love the shade. This is how it looks on my hand. This is the shade number 03 and uh, you saw that how pigmented the shade was. It was absolutely insanely pigmented. It also makes my teeth look quite whiter. So that's why I am absolutely in love with these. And how quickly they turn into matte also that you can see. How quickly they turn into matte and they just stay onto our lips like this. And um, if you are now wanting to transfer it, so there is no transfer. So only if you are having something liquidy or tea or coffee or something or water even. So it, it starts a wear off. But that's uh, that. But that is also very minimal. But it stays really long. So there is no transfer at all. So that's just playing onto my lips. So that is uh, how the pigmentation of all the three shades look. And now let us uh, talk further about these uh, liquid lipsticks. Talk about the staying power of these lipsticks, uh, liquid lipsticks. So they have a pretty good staying power. As I said, they are non-transferable once they are set. So that is a really really good point. And uh, uh, the uh, uh, like staying power is quite good they start last year on three to four hours and after the meal they start to wear off but uh, 
you know if you are uh, having anything liquidy like you're having tea or you're having even drinking water this there will be some or the other wear off but has a good uh, amount of staying power i think it will last you 3 to 4 hours and if you apply two layers of this liquid lipstick i think it it will uh, sustain you a meal also so i'm pretty happy with the staying power of these uh, liquid lipsticks also so i think uh, when we sum up our review i think these liquid lipsticks are very new in market and i think you should you must if you are somebody who is in love with liquid lipsticks and you are bored of miss claire or other affordable brands uh, liquid lipsticks so they can definitely go for these case beauty lip liner plus uh, mac liquid lipsticks because uh, they have good range of shades they are quite affordable and uh, they're good in performance for the price they come for so i really like them and i think you should uh, if you are somebody who is in love with liquid lipsticks and you have been using this miss claire in color matte me lipsticks and all these things so you can definitely give them a try they are really nice and they also come with a liquid lip uh, sorry a lip liner so if you are somebody who uses lip liner a lot then it is a really good buy so uh, i think i'll i'll recommend you that you should go for this liquid lipstick and i have already have three shades and i've been using them day in day in day out so i am pretty happy with them so they can definitely replace my miss claire because it is difficult to find them or other mad lipsticks which are quite costly also so it is i don't know whether it is so it is exact replica of kylie because i have not used the kylie cosmetics liquid lipsticks but it's a good buy so if you are going to consider it as just a matte liquid lipstick it is definitely a great buy guys so i think that's it uh, for this review guys i hope you have enjoyed this and if you did so please like comment and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in my next video bye